Howdy, boys and girls of every age. We're playing Ed to the Gun. <laughs> Welcome back to Ed to the Gun. What? I, I, it's a, it's a new intro. I'm, I'm testing it out. I hate it, but now we know. Howdy, boys and girls of every age. Uh, we're on a streak of 51. <laughs> uh, let's roll our eight-sided die. I didn't open the app. Professional game man. All right. One. I have never had a problem with a one. We take Paradox and uh, shove it right into the gungeon after we professional streamer man up the audio. Good deal. All right, into the gungeon we go for a potential streak of 52. Potential streak of honestly like what, 200 and uh, something something? This is the most plain paradox start I've ever seen. This is just, it's an open book. This is this is a starting character that I've never seen before. It's really just, uh, we got the flash ray, which is not a great gun. But that's fine, because it's a starter. And we get the backpack, so we're kind of like... This is like alternate pilot. This is like, hey everybody, you really hate pilot starter that much? We'll give him another gun, but we're gonna strip away all the other things about him. We've seen you very recently. That... I, uh, it wasn't even... It wasn't yesterday's run, but the run before was... Actually, not clickbait, the title, it said it, and it's true, I think it was the most OP run I think I've ever had. Crown of Guns, you're a sweetheart, and I love you. I'm not sure if it, it if it's right, if it's fair, not fair, but if, it, if it's just to try to take another run and, and take another crack at the, uh, the OP throne. We got the crown, we get the throne. I don't know, man. I don't know. It, it's just, it can go so right. We would need to get an accuracy up for it to really be uh, that great. But it could happen. It could happen. It's actually, there's there's a decent amount of accuracy ups. And it seems like most, uh, like maybe 50% of runs get an accuracy up at some point. If you are trying to get one, you know, like... Seems like there's a fair amount of them that can potentially show up in the shop. Oh, oh! Broke the water barrel! Oh no! But, uh... Let's see. Brown chest. Four chests here. One of the weird scenarios where getting the lockpick, you know, the... If we were like, I want to be... I really thought I killed that one, and I just literally walked into it. I could have sworn I killed, killed it. Whoop. Use the table to our advantage for just a brief moment before we go ahead and break it. But yeah, this run is like, uh, hey, so you, you, you really want an upgraded pile item to shoot things with right away? What is it going to cost you? Everything. Is it? A lockpick would actually be really nice today. Rare scenario, but a true scenario. How did it kill the red boy, but not the, uh, the basic bullet kit, huh? Explain that. For real. Interesting. Um, <laughs> I don't like I like this. That's a, that's a start. That's a start to a run. I'll tell you, we'll definitely steal the crown of guns. It's simple. We steal the crown of guns. So this is definitely a passive. I feel like a brown chest passive... Wait. Obviously, it's not going to be a passive. It's a gun. We just opened up that passive. I just... I thought for a second, because I got the crown of guns, I was like, oh, we just picked up a gun. Nope. We knew that was going to be a gun. That being said, I think we can gun drop the snowballer to some decent effect here. Get him, uh, get him all frozen. Oh, we almost dropped the freeze. Drop the freeze. It's not the uh, 
most invigorating, exciting way to bop the boy. But it's it's relatively safe. He's gonna be um, thought out. He's thought out. Let's go for honestly. Without the accuracy up, flash ray is gonna actually be better. I thought that we were gonna trick him. This might be one of the kind of enemies that just fires no matter what, if you're there or not. If uh, if a Bullet King fires in the forest and no one's around to see it kind of business, you know. Will it... Will it fire? <laughs> oh... Ho, ho, ho... Mama. Okay, first of all, is this locked? I don't think I want this one anyways, but is it... Okay. Eh. Eh. Okay. No. No. We're out of here then. We are out of here then. Hmm, hmm, hmm. An accuracy up would be great. We can get some love out of this snowball there though. It ain't bad. I used to love it. I used to love it. I've since put away childish things. No, it's it's still pretty good. Just needs a bit of damage and explosive rounds can can help it out there. It says, I got you. Uh <clears throat> fam, I got you. Sorry, I had to had to squeeze that one out of my throat. It was a little bit uh, a little bit lodged in there. I believe fam is the word I was looking for. Boy, I just That's one of the That's one of the the what do you call it? I'm, I'm so out of it. What do, what, do you, what do you call those? Uh, slang, lingo. You know, the uh, the, er, the youth youth slang. I, I could never get into uh, fam. I can't get into lit. I can't can't do it. I can't do it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I wish I could. I'm just not lit enough. What is... Overpowered run incoming. I just got a win. All right. Well, that's exciting, but I don't think I want to use it, like, way more than I should. At the same time, you know, we're fighting between using that and, uh, and Crown of Guns, which we really did just have, like, just had a run with. And it was banging then. Lord, it was a banging run. But we don't have anything to really make it extremely good this run anyways. That being said, it's just kind of fun with the explosive rounds anyways. We got what? Six curse? Get them explosions out. Yeah, it's just, it's not really good to use it in that way. Yeah, you can't stop me. Can't stop me now. Ah! Yes! Infinite monies. Thank you. Okay, well that's a guaranteed rat key. Just steal the rat key. Yeah, but I have a chance of getting caught. Hot, since we stole on the last floor. So, I don't know. We don't need to. We can just buy it with all the money we're gonna get. And we're not gonna have to worry about money this run anymore. We got the King Bomber Man. King Bomber Man. Oh, okay. I guess we were charging, so. Uh, I'm gonna do it for the money. I work hard for the money. Even if I get a hit, it's worth it. It's worth it. Why? Because I feel like it. Because I said so in uh, chat. Nice vintage meme there. Oh. 
See, that's why that's why I'm not with uh, 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 Lit and Fam is because I'm back. I'm stuck in uh, I'm stuck in 20, 2012 for my memes and my lingo. Then I just say whatever I darn well feel and uh, whatever sticks is what I go with and say on on loop for the rest of my life. Ah, I'm glad I have the backum pack. I was about to I was about to poo poo on that. Hexagon, I do like you, son, but, uh, I can't take you with me. Can't take you with me, son. Okay, I mean, it's fine. All things considered, it's fine. Answer a Discord question. Link in the description if you care, if you want to talk about it, if you want to learn about the game, or ask me questions that I'll answer in the video. Parmesan <laughs> Parmesan asks, favorite brand of chips? Brand? I kind of like Kettle Brand chips the best. If, if we're just talking sweeping statement brand, if we're talking uh, just like guilty pleasure, just give, give me these chips and I will demolish them. Then straight up, oh my god, that was a bad dodge. Straight up Pringles, like... Give me that, and I'll demolish them. I'll rip them to shreds. Just give me the, uh, the dill pickle Pringles, or like the uh, just the sour cream and onion. Oh, they are gone. They are gone. But I don't know. Like it's already called my favorite because they're like a they're like a they're like a guilty chip for me. Because I'll just eat the whole tube. Let me talk about how it's a chip chips in a tube. First of all, never, never, con never even phases me when I'm eating chips out of a tube. It's like you can't ever, like that. You have to do like they they make the tubes for children, you know. Like I, I like getting the the small ones, the ones that look like they should be for children, because uh, you can actually get your hand all the way down in it without having to tip it out and get the crumble mess. You know, you know what I'm saying. Oh, ye he did it! He did it! Them smooth moves. I've never seen an enemy juke so hard. Holy moly, moly, moly. But yet, yeah, Pringles. Give me them. Ooh, baby. Okay, why did that not bounce? Don't know. Oh, no. Oh, that was almost amazing. Disappointed in you. Disappointed in you. How much money? How much money? Yeah, who needs to steal? <laughs> Did I need to do that? Eh. Probably not. But it felt good. Is there a blank for sale? We're going to get a lot of money. So it doesn't really matter if we want to buy it. All right, well, we'll go down and we'll use our shield. I can't believe the Wii shop is dead, man. Pay respects. Everybody pay your respects. To pay your respects to the Wii shop channel. Subscribe to me on YouTube for daily Into the Gungeon videos. Oh my god! Subscribe to me for great plays such as that. And you'll get videos every single day. Is that, isn't that just such a good deal? For the low, low price of free? That's crazy, man. And, and as a result, you'll pay your respects for it. For the dying Wii Shop, uh, rest its soul. That being said, like... Brief moment. It, it's such a good... The song. Like, who cares? Okay. Real talk. Do I care about this shop? It's a bummer. Like, cause I mean, we could get into an actually uh, more in-depth game topic, such as digital distribution and the preservation of video games. You know, like did some a lot of digital games becoming inaccessible or unpurchasable. Not inaccessible to people who purchase it, but slowly it'll die out, and you won't be able to get the uh, like certain certain games anymore like it's a bummer that being said but yes I'm, I'm bummed about that but really my favorite thing about the Wii shop 
is the song. And if you have not heard it, it is just a gem. And now it's gone. And now I can only listen to it uh, the same way I always listen to it on YouTube. Rest its soul. Subscribe to Retromation on YouTube. Daily anti Dungeon videos and more. Oh. Only way to pay respects, like we Shop would have wanted. Whoop. My god. That was so good until it was bad. It was good until I had to comment on it. That's always how it goes. Also, I'm happy we got Monster Blood before we got irradiated the lead. Because otherwise, all of these explosions that leave these poison balls on the ground, poison pools, would be poisoning your boy as well. Good aim. Your charge. I don't like this room. It's too much happening. Too much happening for, uh, well, I guess it's a floor three room. Thought we were on floor two for some reason. Nah. I love King Bomber. Who thought this was okay? Who thought it was, oh, who thought it was okay to make this big of a banger supreme? New merch on Teespring slash store slash retro Uh, sell out enough? I, I think so. I'm done with that now. No more. No sellouts today. After this. After that. We done here. Oh, everybody subscribe. Everybody who, everybody who's wanted to subscribe, subscribe, right? Like, you wouldn't just be sitting there wanting to subscribe and literally just forgetting to hit the subscribe button. Would you? Would you? Would you? I think you might. It's happened before. I've done it before. It's okay. It's okay. You can come out and say it. Let me know in the comments. Let me know in the comments. Come out and say it. Say, I didn't, I didn't know. I, I, I forgot to subscribe. I genuinely, I forgot to subscribe. I, I wanted to, or I thought about it, but I forgot. It's happened to me before. Whoop. I'm not too, I'm not too proud to admit it. I've forgotten to subscribe before. Okay, can we get more money, please? Thank you. Like I even need it. We have the freaking vampire for extreme vampire in inflation to the economy. These vampires are ruining our gungeon. Ruining our gungeon. We're gonna use something other than the king bomber soon, but right now it just we're throwing money away if we don't use the little bomber. But we do have the ability to steal, so. But we do. Oh, that room is nasty. We do have the ability to steal, but we also have six curse right now because of the finished gun. Which we could always drop, obviously. Like, we just aren't feeling like having it as an obligation. Oh, God. If I had Amulet of the Pit Lord today, I would have made. <laughs> Some serious value out of it. I don't know. I had to go for the 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 long way, the difficult way. Of course I did. Ain't ever doing it the easy way if I don't have to. If I don't have to. Wait, what? All right. Get out of here. Send him. Get some extra money. We don't need to. We don't need to take his money. We're already gonna kill him. Just trying to see if we had any way to do extra damage. It happens. Oh, you gotta be kidding me! I'm Rito the God here. Rito the God here. Most of that was completely carried by the finished gun. Oh. Gungeon, stop reading my dream journal. You can't do that to me. It's so inappropriate. 
There's no way you would have known that that was exactly what I want. It's, it's what I wanted all the time. Rito only wants one thing, and it's disgusting. And it's Gundramata strength. want one thing. It's disgusting. We opened this up, right? Yes, we did. We opened it. Of course we did. Let's see. Amguy asks if all of the Gungeoneers had voice acting, what do you think they'd sound like? Oh, uh, no. You had to set me up with a voice acting challenge. The Paradox would, would sound... Okay, since we're playing as... The Paradox would be all, you know, mystical. Just... I would say it would sound kind of like a like a wisp from Warcraft 3 or something. Just Warcraft. From just Warcraft. But I just have the exact sound of the wisp from Warcraft 3 in my head. Uh, Gunslinger. Oh, he'd be, you know, that one's easy. He'd be, he'd be old and grizzled with a little, maybe a little bit of a southern accent too, I'd say. Up, up, down. Convict, I feel like, would have like a, like a, Deeper Scarlett Johansson style voice. Down right. Let's see. I, I feel like Marine would have a super, super deep voice. Uh, Pilot would have like a, a snappy, you know. You know, like a, a snappier. Uh, almost like the Scout, but not quite as grating. Let's see. Scout from TF2. Right down up. Did I mess it up? I might have messed it up. Let's see. Robot would sound like a robot. Bullet, I feel like, would not have a voice. Even if the game had voice acting, Bullet wouldn't have a voice. It just doesn't seem... I just, I just don't think he would. Uh, Hunter? I, just, I feel like the Hunter would have kind of a deep voice, too. I don't know. Is that everybody? Is that everybody? Wow. Oh. I don't know. As far as they're exactly how they'd sound, I, I I don't have a good uh approximation right now. I'm I don't know. I haven't practiced my, my voice work in a long time. Ever since I auditioned for a lethal league and was shot down. Can you believe it? With no experience shot down? Not fair. Not fair. God, how fun would it be to be a voice in Lethal League, though? God, ah, it's such a good game. I'm gonna try to break this thing today. I just wanna break this thing today. Alright. So which one is that? Uh, who? Shoot. I think that's the, that should be the one that shoots the one attack that I really hate. Which is the, uh, stupid, dang, that, that one rocket one that goes pew, 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 shoots out a million of them. Just not about that life. Crash cannon? I was busy watching the trash can. Ah. Gotta take a chance on something sometime. For real? Two trash cannons. What? Not fair. Don't get twice the trash cannon. And even if I did, I wouldn't want it. Disappointed. Yawn! Yawn, yawn, yawn. Easy is perfect of my life. Easy is perfect of my life. I guess it's not perfect, perfect. Actually, streamer, you didn't uh, get the three-star punch on all of them for all the keys that you're not going to use? Well, actually, I don't care. That's okay. That's okay. All right. Well, let's get some booties. 
Some booties. There's always feeling it's up there. Nope. Last one today. Last one today. We out. Oh. Still have the orange. I could just eat it to get one coolness. Or whatever, one one or two coolness, something like that. I'm kinda just I'm kinda keeping it as a uh as like a potential cheese thing. Like maybe we can possibly get cigaroons. Or we could get I don't know, Mendy and Patches. We could, I don't know why we would that would do anything. I don't, like maybe there's something we could do to abuse the health. We should have done it with the vampire, but honestly, money is not what we need. I would take coolness. Money is just really not what we need. So that's why I didn't do the vampire. Because honestly, quite frankly, the economy of the gungeon is already destroyed. The value of a casing is, is just, frankly, disheartening already. Yoink. Now you got the finish gun, so we could really just use that the whole run, but you know, where's the fun in that, man? Where's the fun in that? We'll use it for some bosses and just to just as doink around from here and there. Oh. Bop ba 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 ba. Get the AoE poison explosion too. Out of the commando, so there's something there. The Wiggly Hero, would you rather restart Gungeon or your skill level? Uh, like do a save file, reset my save file on Gungeon or my saves, my uh, my skill, definitely my save file, because that's something that I've talked about, talked about doing, and I probably will do at some point, which is literally just a, a fresh save file. That's, you know, I, I'll probably do that at some point, like for sure. That that sounds like a, a fun thing to try someday. Well, that probably a ways out. Probably a ways out, though. Oh, my God. You guys can let me know, though, what you would think about that idea. Let me know in the comments below, because that, that's, uh, that's something I could see people loving or hating. I could see that being, like, some people being like, oh, please do it. That's It's new and exciting, and it's novel. And some people being like, why would you do that? You're just taking away a lot of the cool items that could show up. The runs are going to be a lot more similar. The runs are going to be shorter because you can only go to the dragon for a long time. Um, but then it'd also be like, hey, you get, to, you get to see the pasts again because there's no reason to go to the past unless you just want your run to be over quicker. I don't know. There's no reason to go to the past. It just doesn't feel like the correct end. And it's really jarring to think that you can go literally from the advanced dragon to just doing a pass. That's really jarring. Make no sense. Up, 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 up. Never got accuracy. But, I don't know. If someday modding of this level, of this caliber is possible, I think it would be cool if uh, you could mod it so, or maybe just, like, it wouldn't even have to be more complicated. It, like, if, I know that it's possible to, like, modify floors, but it'd be really cool to see a new take, a new take on the pasts. It would be a lot of work, I bet, but, um, you know, just, like, Instead of just the normal past, if you could use the tile sets from those to to make a whole new floor or something, you know? That would be cool. Like, a, a short but difficult floor. Like, a floor a la, like, the RNG department. That size, that kind of difficult. Maybe a little bit harder. You keep all your stuff. I think that'd be cool. Hard, like harder, but harder, but using the same assets. 
And you know, like, you'd have to, bosses would definitely have to be harder than they are now. But I think it could be really cool. Wow, we have so much poison resistance redundancy. Like, hello? Courage. Muriel. Alright. Very challenging boss to fight with the finished gun. I almost cared. That would have been a close one. Oh, okay. We can we can get rid of the stealing now. Watch it. Watch us not have enough money for whatever we want now. We can sell that. So that I said, I said we can sell that, sell that. All right. Well, now we don't have to worry about money at all. Here, the other point. We're good. We are good. Mango Man asks. Have you worked in retail or fast food before? Uh, very yeah. I, in fact, I currently still do a bit. I, I, I work retail. I do indeed. This ain't quite my only job. Just, just not, just not, just barely, just barely. We're on the fence, buckos. We're on the fence. Like I could, I could maybe do it, but it'd be stupid. You know, like is that is kind of where I'm at. I could do it, but it'd be dumb right now. It'd be very, very dumb and insecure. It would be a huge leap of faith to do it right now. So yes, I, for the moment. Okay, so 2.5. Let me think. 2.5 plus. We are so not able to get that. If we had the ability to steal. Oh, if we had the ability to steal, that would have been good. Honestly, I should have just eaten my orange. But I just I thought I would I thought it was more likely that I would kick myself for, uh, for dropping the orange and we would get some reason to use use it, I don't know. Then um, kicking myself for getting rid of the stealing item. But I you know, I guess I I forgot about the uh, the whole being a, a good thing to use on curse luck cuz instead of the 2.5 curse you get for buying stuff, you only get one curse for stealing. It does bypass it. So, it's a pretty, pretty big get, pretty baguette right there. If we would have done that, we would have been able to, I think, we might have still spawned the Lord of the Jammed. Honestly, it might be worth it. Super high coolness, Elder Blank. Would be a good deal. Fun thing to have. Oh, freak out. And we got rid of the Book of Chest Anatomy. Ain't it just the way? You gonna die for me, please? Die for me, big boy. Okay. Probably, I, just, I feel so dirty using the finished gun. Let's just switch it up. I feel like I'm not supposed to use the RC rocket either because we're going to use it on bosses, but if I'm using the finished gun on bosses, I guess we can use the RC gun. Right? I suppose. If we're not going to use it on bosses, we might as well use it on rooms. I, the, the math checks out. He did the math. That's a boss. That's a big screen right there. Like playing Gungeon on a Jumbotron. The latency would be so bad. I, I couldn't imagine it being good. But that being said, it's uh, it would be such a gamer moment, you know, to play on a play in a movie theater. That's always what I wanted to do, like as a kid. I wanted to play Super Smash Brothers. Input like, oh my god, that'd be so bad. But. I, I, I always wanted to play like Super Smash Brothers Melee on uh, in the in a movie theater. Sounds like a blast. 
Disappointed. Waste another technically like wasteful gun in normal circumstances to be using in this situation, but we're gonna be using the finish gun on the boss, so who cares? We're gonna use this gun in a kind of new context. I never feel like I can use this for rooms. And I still probably shouldn't feel like I can. You can't stop me now. Because I'm using commando, going commando. Ooh, it's such a strong gun for this room. Let's use this. Yeah, boy. That's a good one. That's a good one. This is one of my favorites. One of my favorites. Oh, okay. We take those. We take those. Just because you're simple doesn't mean you're not valuable. Just because you're normal doesn't mean you stink. Words to live by. Very obvious words to live by. Doink. Get out of here. He even gave me the key to open his chest. That's adorable. Now I have to put it to the test. He, now he said it, so he has to do it. Incoming Lord of Miss Your Jam. Somebody rang? You rang? It's okay. What do we got for ammo in that? 166. Ah, not great. Got coolness out the wazoo, though. Give the Elder Blank like a son of a gun. Oh! I missed my orange. We haven't found the blacksmith yet. Okay, so fill it up. That's the blacksmith, right? Yeah. Okay. I saw. Ooh, I saw some adorable things there. Hydrate. Delicious. Delicioso. Why not? I'll take your entire stock. And then leap. Hmm. I'm tempted to actually not use that stinking thing here because if we go to the next floor uh we got ghost bullets it's okay they're still actually they're working pretty well funny enough uh, if we go to the next floor and we don't switch our weapon then we won't spawn the lord of the jam call <laughs> jam it It's okay, we do so much damage, so much damage. It is amazing. My best friend, we work together. Why does it not, Lord of the Jam's too smart for that. Cause you gotta wake up pretty early in the morning to uh, get the worm. It's absolutely the phrase, I don't know what you're talking about. All right, we're gonna have to do psycho. That's surprising probably nobody. That's a two second. However, disappointing me. Hate this. Ah! Don't let him get you twice, sir. All right, good deal. Ash and Shotgun can ask, what is your favorite character from the Binding of Isaac after Earth Plus? Uh, Judas. Definitely. My boy Judas. Judge Judas. I believe is the uh, is the show. Okay. I am out of here. Bitch. 
Make sure we're holding this. Bum, 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 ba, bum. Ah, yes. Do not switch guns. Do not pick up ammo unless we need it. Which we probably will near the end. Them rocket bullets, we're slapping them good. Let's try to be a little bit smarter with our ammo with this. It's, it's so easy with this gun to not care. Because it has so much and usually... Oh, it, that, see, that's a trap. But we did kill the rest. So we can come back for it. I forgot. Wow, this is amazing. So now we can literally use it until it runs out of ammo. Before we have to spawn the Lord of the Jammed. And we can still use the dang gun. I feel like there's some other weird thing that does spawn the Lord of the Jammed that I haven't quite remembered. Oiled Cylinder is putting in the time. Putting in the time. Love that rocket bullet. Rocket punch. Okay, maybe push him in the pit. Oh. You get a key, well, maybe I'll care. <laughs> eh, not really a room where a decoy will matter much. Halfway out of ammo. We're going to need to spawn the Lord of the Jam if we want to keep on using... Well, I mean, we're going to have to spawn the Lord of the Jam. Because if we don't want to keep on using this, well, then guess what? We don't have a gun. So we'll be out. I love having so much coolness that I feel like I can literally just use the Elder Blank as a get the heck away from me. That is satisfying. You don't need to be too worried about, you know, using up your, uh, your charge when you get it every three seconds. Good aiming. Okay. Get in the pit. You fell into the pit. I wonder, I wonder, are we going to run out before, oh, ouch, are we going to run out before the, uh, the floor is over? I, my guess is yes, but I think that we are actually taking a pretty accurate path to the boss. So it's going to be close, we're going to basically not have to do anything with the, with the Lord of the Jam present. Who is, I, uh, I must say, it's not that bad, really. Oh, thank you, I'm just making it so I don't have to go back very far. That being said, I probably am going to. can do it. Give it an old pick up. Old pick me up. And I guess we will bring the Lord of the Jam back here a little ways and that's enough. I'm not going to cheese any more than that. That's plenty. Plenty of cheese. Thank you very much. Oh. Delete him. Yeah, okay, we, had, we still had another uh, another hallway, another divergent path to go for. Honestly, we can use the Lord of the Jam to our advantage on this run a lot of times. So we got the finished gun, we can push all these bullets back. And I'm not really worried about death. I feared not death. I don't know the meaning of the word. 
which you define it. Okay. This screaming boss path to me. Boss path! You hear it? Oh. Shoot fly? That's boss path. That's a boss path if I've ever seen one. Oh. Fill it up. I know we could get even more value, but I'm not gonna bother. And I'm not gonna cheese anymore because, quite frankly, we don't need to. As simple as that. Goes the Lich. <laughs> we have so many bullet modifiers today that are just making us so dang clean. That's the that's the unspoken. This D jams enemies? No. Oh, okay. No, it doesn't. It just made it look like it did. Nope. 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 When did we get bouncy bullets? I didn't think this bounced this much. See ya. God, I love Gundromeda Strain. Don't you? Don't you just love Gundromeda Strain? This is insane. Why did I do that? Probably because it doesn't matter much. I like those back. I guess I probably... You can! Here comes the big one. Big boy! Oh my god. I didn't even think he was gonna die. I was gonna switch my guns up, but I just... I thought he was gonna take a little bit longer. Don't you dare touch me, you Lord of the Jam. Well, see you later. Bye. Bye, Lord of the Jam. That is a streak of 52... Easy peasy streak of 52 under our belt. Thank you, everybody, for watching. If you made it this far, do consider subscribing if you haven't. I do upload Enter the Gungeon every single day. I upload other stuff as well that you might want to check out. Follow me on twitch.tv slash retromation to catch me streaming games live and join the Discord if you want to ask questions that I'll answer in videos like I did today. Or just to talk about Enter the Gungeon, learn about the game, stuff of that nature. Thank you, thank you. See you next time.